Hi everyone, I'm Elisa with EECC Travels and I am here to do a quick update on the changes that have happened with the Pixels packages from Carnival Cruise Line. So earlier this week, um, I made a video about our experience with the package. So we were on the Carnival Breeze on April 1st. They had just announced packages. We bought what they called at that point Pixels Plus Digital. So we got all of our photos and then we got them all on a digital flash drive. If you haven't seen that video yet, I'll leave a link to it down in the description. But right after I released that video, Carnival changed things. So at first prices jumped way up. A lot of people got upset. Carnival listened, brought the prices back down, and actually made some improvements to the package. So what they are now. Package number one, what they're calling the Pixels package for $99.98 or $100. You get five of any of the photos you want plus a canvas print. Okay, so that is the only package that has not changed from the beginning. Package number two is called Pixels Plus. So it's $199.98 or $200 and it is all of your prints. All of your prints, okay. Here's the difference. If you're on a digital ship, all of your prints will be digital. If you're not on a digital ship, all of your prints will be printed. Okay, but either way, you get all of your prints. Package number three is called Pixels Max. So this package is all of your prints plus 50. Now here, here's where we go in the, if you're on a digital ship. So if you're on a digital ship, all of your prints will be digital. Then you get to choose your favorite 50 and they will print them. On the flip side of that, if you're not on a digital ship, all of your prints will be printed and they will take your favorite 50 and put them on a flash drive for you. Okay, so now you're going to wonder which ships are digital. Digital ships are Vista, Horizon, Panorama, Breeze, Conquest, Magic, and Victory. So those are the ships that are digital as of today. They will probably be rotating some of these ships or transitioning some of these ships to the digital format in the very near future. So if you book a package and you're buying the say you're buying the all of the prints package and the ship that you're booking on is say the carnival dream that is not a digital ship but you're buying the package for your cruise that's six months from now six months from now they may have transit transitioned that ship to a digital ship and at that time your package will become a digital package okay here's a few notes about the fine print this is what's going to be in the fine print of these packages Number one, it must be purchased pre-cruise. So you can't buy it the day of. It has to be at least the day before your cruise that you purchase this package. Now they have said that they are gonna offer these packages on the ship, but they will be more. So they're saying these prices are 20% less than you're gonna pay for them on the ship. So if you're looking at doing this, I recommend buying it ahead of time. You're gonna save a good bit of money, okay? Okay, only photos associated with the stateroom number that the package is purchased under will be part of the package. So for instance, if you've got more than one cabin and you buy the package under cabin number 1234, make sure when you go up to the photographers, you give cabin number 1234 because any other photos that you take will not be included in your package. Also, at least one person in your stateroom has to be in the picture. Or if you have a, if you have a large family and you have two staterooms and you've got adults in one and kids in the other or a mixture of two, the kids in the other stateroom will count as well. So for instance, our family gets two staterooms. We put an adult and two kids and then adult and kids. Both of those staterooms can be in one package, but your friend that's staying next door, they can't be. Now, they can be in your pictures. So if me and my husband and we have a couple of friends and they wanna all, we all wanna take a picture together, yes, that's included. But the friends cannot take a picture on their own, that would not be included. Does that make sense? Okay. That's going into groups. So if you have a group of 10 or more, that's not gonna be included. They're gonna consider that a group photo and that will not be included in your package. 
Also, if you do a booking of a dream studio, these are special packages that Carnival does. They're gonna give you a specific photographer. They're gonna take special pictures of you. That's its own package. So you, a dream package will not be in this package. Okay, print sizes are going to vary. So a lot of times you'll go take different pictures and you might have some formal night pictures and you'll have embarkation pictures and you'll have port day pictures. When you go into the gallery and you see all these pictures, you're gonna see some are eight by tens, some are five by sevens, and some are and some are six by nines. Whatever print, whatever size print the picture comes out as, that's the size that's included in the package. The exception is gonna be your digital ships. Your digital ships all your prints are going to be 8 by 10. Okay, any pictures taken on the last evening of the cruise will not be available in digital format. They will only be available in print. So keep that in mind. Try and take your pictures earlier in the cruise. Don't wait till the end of the cruise to take those photos because you're not going to be able to either get both or you're not going to be able to get that digital image. Okay, all photos must be redeemed during the voyage. So you can't get home and go, oh, you know, I really like that picture that we took in Cozumel. You'll be too late. You won't be able to get it. You have to redeem them all during your voyage. Also, if you purchase photos through the Carnival Hub app, those photos will not be included in the package. You can view them on the Carnival Hub app, but don't click the buy now because if you have the package, you need to redeem it through the Pixels Gallery. Okay, if you're not on a digital ship, you're gonna need to go to the Pixels Gallery once a day or once every other day and collect all the photos that are up on the wall that are of you and your family and give them to the person that's working in the gallery and they will put them in your folder so that at the end of the cruise you can come and you can collect them all. Okay, one other important thing to remember is you have to activate your package. So if you buy it online, you're going to get a ticket delivered to your room that says you have bought this Pixels package. You have to take that piece of paper to the Pixels gallery to activate your package. And it has to be done on days one or two of the cruise. If you wait till day three, you may have some problems getting your package activated. The rules state it has to be done by day two. Okay, so I hope this has helped everyone understand the changes in the new photo packages. I think these are good changes. I think these are good, um, well-valued photo packages. Um, I know, for instance, if we would have been sailing now instead of on April 1st, we'd have actually saved $50 because we would have, we were on the Breeze, which is a digital ship. We would have bought the all, all photos package for $199. And we would have saved $50, so I think this is really a great change they're making. If you didn't see the video I put out earlier this week of our experience with the photo package, that's, that link's going to be in the description. You can really see all the backgrounds, all the different um, types of photo ops that are included in the package. You can really get your money's worth, so be sure and check out that video. And if you've liked this video, please give it a big thumbs up. If you're new to our channel, please subscribe for more cruise videos to come. And thanks for watching. Happy cruising!